fluxes. Uh, stuff. I saw Kage tweet that he'd put some money down, <laughs> and I also saw the no fluxes like shit talking some fox thing about two or three days ago. <laughs> Those so are the last funny. things I've seen. Yeah, it's funny. The ga game oh. players are the best, dude. Yeah, you know they they like their anime storylines. <laughs> okay, interesting pivot there. Ooh, dash that cross up. Yeah, so Nikonix, as you see, he's very slick, and uh, if a Ganon gets scared or gets baited, they're just gonna get dumpstered. So he's using that like down holding strategy that I said, so that's kind of a good sign. He's oh yeah, there you go, right there, like you're talking about. But I think playing a little f with his like face forward to Falcon too much. I mm. think that you can do pretty well like trying to gain some space. He's like back airs and oh, oh misses the Tipman attempt. Yeah, you can do that a lot later. Also, uh, so on top of those double spots, I just again has done four grabs and none of them connected, and they were Let's pretty. Let's see how they get off the ball. ledge. Okay, yeah. they okay, had the nice grab. like <laughs> instant um, no get up, man. but no, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, very easy for Ganon. Also nice because you can't SD, because at worst you just re-grab the ledge. Yeah, it's like instant, a jab or something too, so good. He has pretty good ledge options. And if he had committed to that crouch cancel, he might have been really going to grab. Like oh. you're saying though, Nikonic's a good oh. player and showing it <laughs> off right there. Nipple spike to the depths. Oh. Sent to bikini bottom. Oh, oh my that gosh. pivot grab. Is he going to take any more percent? Nikonic's looking for a JV4. <laughs> Oh. Might find it with oh, the yeah, couple zero to deaths in a row. Oh, we're about to have it. You could. Oh, he's trying to do some weed lord things where instead of comboing, oh. you wave land. Oh, me the the oh. up B on the platform is the surfero. Oh, he yeah. would always do that when I play. Oh my gosh, 150. Oh. What is this? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Iconics going in. That Side was dash, gnarly. Pivot instant up air. Very nice. Getting a tall character, so it's not very very strong against him. Will stuff out anything he does except for maybe an upward angle forward tilt. Man, the comics was moving there. Did not even get hit. <laughs> That's what we're talking about too, though. You can make the matchup so oppressive if you move away from him and just use that speed against them. Absolutely, Ganon just can't contest that at all. As long as you're moving in safe places and just getting cool. to an advantageous spot before you go in, Falcon has all the time in the world to do that because you can just outpace him so hard. Yeah, you can see the Gan getting baited sometimes too, right? Like into doing that side B out of the corner. Uh, so this Gan player isn't very fast either. I know like Gan is slow, but yeah, not you seeing can, the you Gan can make it look ice. fast. Like yeah. the Murlocs, the Fluxes. There's a lot of people who make Gan look fast. Prometheus. Right. Uh, he hasn't really been able to use the platforms in any way to like assert himself in neutral either. Uh, it's 1-0. One one for Iconics. the Falcon. Yeah, the Falcon. We can't see it. Uh, uh, the Falcon's tag is the one that says Nico. So Nikonix is his real tag. Um, and he's up 1-0. Ooh. Uh, Nikonix could go for re-grabs on these uh, down throws when the Ganon does not DI down and away. Really, if you do anything except re-grab, they can jump out. So the Ganon should DI that down throw to get tech chase instead, but uh, that's not happening. Right there, when he fares at, or up airs out of shield, Ganon really needs to punish that with, with the forward air. Yeah, I, there's also a lot of times where Ganon oh. finally gets stage position and then just like runs into the corner and Falcon will regain stage control. I think he needs to be playing center stage a lot harder. And oh. Like that right oh. there. He's up, he's he's up a again. lot this game though, Yeah, somehow. So yeah, Nikonic's not hitting as hard as he could. Uh, we've seen a lot of missed techs from H. Cox as well. So I don't know if that's his actual tag, by the way, but that's it is interesting the <laughs> uh, momentum change. Yeah. Oh, see, not not a good dash chance from Nikonic either, right? See, yeah, that that's something that I've kind of taught myself a little mantra is I feel like you, you can get stuck in that no man's land where you're in between, like right in front of oh. Ganon, but not in his face. And I feel like that's a time where you get caught holding <laughs> out a lot. Yeah, Nikonic's just throwing away that stock, basically. But you'll kind of get caught like dash dancing like that and get hit by a stray aerial, and you're holding back trying to dash dance and fly off stage. And that I think it's better to either maintain a lot of space against Ganon or stay on top of them. Okay, so apparently Nikonic goes by Dookie Brown Hat right now. Oh, so he could have like punished that jump too. Okay. Pokemon Stadium, by the way, this is a uh, 
this is a free win for Falcon. So we'll see how bad it looks for Ganon. Yeah, uh, the platforms are so much harder for Ganon to use to approach or use in a meaningful way if Falcon wants to just play center. Yeah, Falcon can dash ants really easily with the long stage. too. Because the you know, platforms don't like get you across the stage. Oh, like Yoshi's, you're you can go the entire way. <laughs> right. Just one platform. Right. From the top platform, we hit virtually the whole stage. You know, Nikonix has not, or <laughs> Dookie Brown Hat has not been ledge guarding well. Uh, punishing the end lag on uh, the down bees from Dolpha would make a big difference. In Dolpha. general, not doing the best job of like punishing when the Ganon. Yo, shout that. out to Dookie Brown Hat. Oh, for real. DBH. <laughs> Ganon's tournament winner, DBH. go very high. Uh, <laughs> can't hit it with a short off up air. Right, is that not quite the hard knee, but be a pivotal stock, honestly. If Ganon can find this oh. first. See, like if he had just dashed and jumped towards him instead of moonwalking, he could have killed him, but he gets it anyway. Yeah, the simple aerials seem to be netting a lot. The nares, the up airs. Ooh. Oh, wow. This is... Ganon just has not been able to start anything. Oh, oh wow. God. Um. Ouch. Yeah, Ganon, uh, Ganon's recovery is not very good, and he has trouble sweet spotting in general, too. One thing about Ganon too is like against other characters he hits harder than oh. they do, but that's not really the case in this matchup. Oh, Falcon should actually like hit Ganon harder than the other way around. Yeah, great edge cancels oh. from the comics as well. Good wow. set. <laughs> a classic yeah. matchup, you know, you can see it enough, but uh, there's only a few Ganons like Epic Marlock and some others who make the matchup look doable. Yeah, that was a good set though. That. It was crazy the momentum shift in that game too after the JV4 stock yeah. in game one. Yeah, and I think Dolfo, like he had some of the right ideas, but you could see he wasn't getting like any punishes off of his crowd cancel game. 